Hello guys and welcome back to another video. I think spring is finally here and to kick off my spring cleaning, I wanted to do some decluttering and I'm gonna be taking you guys along in this video. So let's get going. I thought I would start in the master bedroom and just go through the nightstands, my dresser, and also our master bath. My nightstand is pretty empty already. I just have a book that I'm reading, a notepad, an old glasses case, a Nintendo DS, if anyone remembers this thing. I don't really play it, but it's just very nostalgic, so I keep it in here. And I do have games on there. Eye masks, some creams and pens, and another glasses box. That's pretty much it. So I've decluttered. I have this empty diaper balm that I kept to let Ruben play with, but I think he's over it, so I'm gonna toss that. And then this is just another eye mask that I'm going to be decluttering because I already have two other ones that I wear more often, so I'm gonna declutter this. I'm not gonna go through JT's nightstand, but he is pretty much minimalist and he doesn't really have anything in there other than the two books, and I'm not decluttering those, so just gonna leave that there. Here's my little jewelry box. I'm not decluttering anything because I know all the pieces that are in there and I like them all, so I'm gonna keep them all. Anything from here, this pen just should not be here, but I'm not decluttering this and my makeup is fine as well. I'm a little nervous to go through the bathroom drawers because they do kind of get out of hand over time. Products just end up going in whichever drawer is convenient. So I'm gonna declutter and also do a little bit of organizing at the same time. All right, so here is drawer one. And here's what I mean by it sort of gets kind of messy and <laughs> things just go wherever it's convenient, which is typically the top drawer. So I have a whole bunch of like scrunchies, hair elastics. I'm gonna move them back to the right spot. Um, combs and things. This is not too bad. I quickly go through this drawer and see if there's anything to declutter and just um, organize it back. <laughs> So nothing to declutter from this drawer, just needed a bit of organization. And I'm gonna move the hair elastics back to its spot. Okay, next drawer. So I'm just gonna go through the rest of the drawers and I will come back and let you guys know if I've decluttered anything. Just decluttering this scrunchie that is super stretched out. I'm gonna just put it into textile donations. Some other hair elastics that I don't really wear, so I'm going to declutter these. Um, this bag that was just kind of floating around, also textiles. And then some garbage that just never got recycled. And then sometimes I save like these jars after I finish products, thinking that I might use them, but I haven't found a use for them in a long time, so I'm going to just recycle them. So far, I've just done our master bathroom and bedroom. It's mostly just trash and recycling so far. Ruben should be waking up from his nap soon, so I might have to put a pause on this video and continue another time, but in the meantime, I'm just gonna head downstairs and see if I can get started in the kitchen. Okay, I'm gonna head into the pantry here. Um, Just looking at it, it doesn't look like there's too much to declutter, but I'm gonna pull a couple of things and I'll share with you what I declutter. I mean, it doesn't really need any decluttering. I think what it needs is actually a little reorganization again, cause it's clearly gotten out of hand and we now have like these baby items that we just kind of just shove here on this middle shelf. So I think, I might have to do another reorganization of the pantry. Just found these two items to declutter, an old chocolate tin and this random gold tray. Going to declutter these two things. And next up, I'm going to tackle these cabinets here under the counter. I haven't looked under here in a while. I don't know if there's anything to declutter, but it doesn't hurt to take a peek. Got some matches and some birthday candles. It's like in just in case things. Some fable dinnerware and some dinner candles that I have yet to light because I don't have a candle stick holder, but I love these. Anyway, there's nothing to declutter from here. Let's check out this middle drawer. 
And yes, these are all the photos that I printed from Costco. We are looking for like a traditional photo album like with the pockets. If anyone out there has a good suggestion, let me know in the comments below. All right, in here we have like board games and things, boggle, bananagrams, choking hazards for babies. Haven't touched those in a while. Our wedding album, my baby photo album. I have these cards from the KiwiCo boxes. I think I'm gonna declutter them because I mean, I don't actually really look at them. So they're going. These postcards that my friend drew, uh, we were planning to hang these up somewhere in the kitchen. So I'm gonna keep this in this little tray that I have. Just not sure where to hang it yet. So that's why it's sitting in here. My box for my Bible, Ooh, my records. This is like another random junk drawer. In-ears, disposable camera that needs to be developed, random cables and things. Okay, this can just stay in here. In here, it's just like manuals for our kitchen appliances and things. I guess I don't really need this. I might keep this. Okay, looking pretty good. It's pretty empty in here. Not bad. Okay, this one's a little bit disastrous. We have um, some extra film. Not bad in there. All we got rid of was some old papers and things that again can just be recycled. Perfect. Okay, so I'm done under the cabinets. Ruben is still sleeping, but it's getting closer to hours, so I'm gonna go wake him up. So, Mr. Ruben is awake. Gonna get him ready for a little snack. Okay, we got some bedhead. Hello, Mr. Greenmouth. <laughs> He's having some little corn snacks. First time trying these, we'll see. They're a hit. And while Ruben's having his snacks, I'm also having my snacks. So we are in the kind of family room area, TV room. And so I thought I would just declutter this area while Ruben is playing and reading this indestructible book. I don't think there's too much to declutter here. It's mostly just books and our speaker system and just like decor and some of his toys, which we don't need to declutter just yet. So yeah, I'm gonna take a look at the desk situation and see if there's anything that could be decluttered. Yep, so nothing to declutter on that bookshelf, nothing here. I just had some paperwork that I moved off the desk and I'm gonna file it away. Everything else is good to stay. Right, Ruben? Yeah. I'm gonna go through his crates of toys. I'm pretty sure there's nothing to declutter. But I will. Yeah? Are you worried I'm gonna declutter all your toys? I'm gonna go through those and see if there's anything that I can declutter. And yeah, let's go. Not much from here, honestly. Just this plastic container of rice that I made for Ruben. Um, to shake with, but he's not super interested in this. He's got other shakers that he likes more. So I am going to put this rice back and recycle the container. You trying to get over that? <laughs> Careful, please. <laughs> Careful, please. Oh, oh, okay. Now you want to play with it. Now you want to play with it. You never play with this. Well, guess I'm not decluttering it just yet. While I'm here, I'm just gonna quickly tidy up the couch a bit, and yeah, that's it. Ruben, come help me declutter your boxes. Can I get rid of this one? What do you think? Can I get rid of the Huggies box? Or this one? Or what about the cereal box? Can I get rid of this one? Which one? <laughs> Boom. Next up is a little play area. I'm gonna go through everything. I'm pretty sure, again, there's nothing to declutter, but I mean, it doesn't hurt to kind of clean it up as well. On a side note, best Kijiji find ever. Ruben loves crawling through the tunnel. <laughs> so 
So as I suspected, not much to declutter in the playroom, just some packaging from a play mat. <laughs> Quickly, I'm gonna tackle this drawer because I know there's pretty much nothing to declutter in here except for this butter container, which I actually took from my sister when she was decluttering her kitchen. I'm giving it back to her because it doesn't fit my butter, the butter that I buy for some reason. Everything else is gonna stay in this drawer. Honestly, not much from here. Just this burlap sack and these two little plastic um, scoops that we don't have use for. So I'm gonna declutter these. Hello, it is Friday. Welcome back to the vlog. I'm gonna get back to decluttering today. I just finished filming an outfit reel. So if you're into slow fashion, sustainable fashion, and outfits and things like that, I share more of my day-to-day -day outfits over on Instagram. So make sure to check out my account. All right, just gonna sit you guys down for a second. Get this hair up. I really need to do another haircut soon because it's getting very long. Okay, so hair is out of the way. I'm gonna see if there's anything else in the kitchen that I need to declutter and then we might head downstairs and continue with the decluttering. I recently went through all of my glassware and mugs. I think it's good, so I'm gonna keep this. This is fine um, and I know that my dishes are also fine. I think over here, we're good as well. So nothing to do there. I'm gonna just check this cabinet here. This is where it's kind of a mess again. Um, we store water bottles, thermoses, and also extra jars and things like that, and some other Tupperware containers. So I'm gonna go through this. I don't think there's anything to get rid of, but uh, you never know. So just did a little bit of a reorganization. I didn't declutter any of our bottles, just have our water bottles, thermoses, and then these are lids and jar lids and things like that. These two containers we use to wash our veggies and fruits and store them. They're not in use right now, but we actually use these a lot more. I don't know why I was putting it so high up. So I just swapped this section here. So the things we use more down here and then the jars I put up there and then some like camping cups and stuff and then it's very empty. We don't have a ton of things but we do also have a lot of storage so there's a lot of empty space up here. <laughs> oh so all I decluttered from here were two takeout container lids which I have recycled. From our utensils I know I want to get rid of this guy because the silicone is starting to peel but before I get rid of it I want to make sure we have a replacement one but we haven't had a chance to get a new one yet so I'm gonna wait on that and everything else is good we use everything else so let me check this guy this one is oh this one is also starting to peel so i know these guys have got to go soon um we just have to wait till we get some new ones so leave them here for now okay guys let's head downstairs and see what we can declutter and organize so first, I'm just gonna go to our little gym area here. I don't even know what's in this ottoman, but we'll see. We kind of have this random ottoman that's full of um, random stuff. This is really random. Definitely need to go through this and see how we can reorganize this. Actually, the rest of this stuff is all of JT's work stuff. So I'm just gonna leave this bin like this. Maybe organize it a bit for him. What we're getting rid of, this is not much of a decluttering video, more like uh, getting rid of uh, random junk that we have, like this wrapping paper tube. So I'm gonna recycle that. This poster I'm gonna put in the basement for now because we don't have a place for it yet. And then this little amp, I will probably just use it for decoration in the music area. Okay, so I got a little carried away decluttering the laundry room. Here is what I'm decluttering, some sample detergent things that we got in the mail that we don't use. And then this bag here that my dryer balls came in. Time for a little muffin snack break. Made these mixed berry muffins the other night. Mm -hmm. Okay, just finished my snack and I totally realized I forgot to go through these cabinets here. So let's take a peek. this yeah, vitamin D drop bottle that's empty. I don't know why we kept it, getting rid of that. 
Uh, I'm going to declutter these sample bottles because they're both scented and Ruben can only use unscented cream because he's very sensitive. Okay, so nothing to declutter from here. Baby stuff, baking, Dutch oven things, baking trays, and then some gift bags that I've gone through. <laughs> I've gone through them recently, so uh, I know there's nothing to declutter there. Hi, Ruben. Good morning. Okay, guys, we are here in my office slash kind of like a dumping ground. Ugh, everything's in this closet. I mean, it's not the worst, but there are probably some things that I could declutter from here. I should probably also reorganize my desk area. decluttered just a little bit of reorganization again this is really just like a storage closet at the moment it's not the greatest organization solution but it's what we have right now i'm not really decluttering these things and just putting them back to the right spot i don't know this i used to like turn some fabric when i was sewing and then i just got a bunch of like loose string that i need to toss out and some trash Hello guys, today is Saturday. I actually finished decluttering yesterday. I just wanted to hop on here and say a quick thank you for watching this video and decluttering with me. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments below if you're getting started on your spring cleaning. I'd love to hear from you in the comments, so make sure to leave me a message. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.